Does Apple hold any XRP tokens? What did Apple just reveal about XRP? Is this true or just a rumor? If you want to learn all about it, then keep on watching this video to find out more so that you don't miss out on an excellent opportunity to win a giveaway of 50 XRP tokens at the end of this month. Hello guys, welcome to Whiteboard Crypto Update, the number one YouTube channel for crypto education. In today's video, we will talk about XRP and what Apple said about XRP. So be sure to stay focused as you surely don't want to miss out on this. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications by hitting the bell so you never miss any of our uploads and also enter our giveaway. Now with the intro out of the way, let's get into our topic for today. The majority of our transactions and interactions take place on the internet these days. This does not simply involve the increasing usage of social media for communication. The majority of users now utilize an internet banking system even if internet banking makes banking transactions more manageable and more comfortable. However, there are still some glitches that affect how we use this system. This is where cryptocurrencies come into play. Cryptocurrency is a type of electronic money, one such digital currency is the XRP cryptocurrency. XRP was created neither as an alternative means of payment nor as an alternative to traditional paper money and the entire banking system. The purpose of XRP is the emergence of a new calculation method for the banking system, that is, creating an alternative system of interbank transfers with a minimum commission. The main goal of the Ripple protocol is to ensure a high speed of money transfers. The system uses a consensus registry to record transactions, which differs in many ways from the classic blockchain. In traditional consensus algorithms, such as proof-of-work or proof-of-stake, trust in nodes is formed based on their computing power or balance value. In Ripple, trust is built on the reputation of the owners of node validators, which are banks and other registered companies Axis Bank, American Express. Confirmation of transactions is carried out by reaching an agreement on their authenticity between the validators. As investors and fans know, XRP is designed to address the most pressing issues, such as high transaction rates and highly long processing times. Moreover, Apple has released an Apple book on its website with the name XRP, the next Bitcoin. The author of this book is Jay Davidson. There is no doubt that XRP will be the next Bitcoin. But despite knowing this, there is still so much competition out there regardless of the lawsuit in which XRP is now with the SEC handling so much pressure with the hurdles. Apple has books on their website on which talk about XRP and Ripple being involved in shady merchants. Just a few years ago, the term cryptocurrency must have indicated some skeptical or underground banking or monetary concept, but nevertheless, the entire scenario has undergone a paradigm shift today. In truth, the fiat system is being rattled by a pandemic that cannot survive the recession. So at the end of the day, the question is whether cryptocurrencies are here to stay. Cryptocurrencies have surged so much that their total value has reached nearly $2.5 trillion, rivaling the world's most valuable company, Apple, and have amassed more than 200 million users. At this size, it's simply too big for the financial establishment to ignore. Firms that cater to the world's wealthiest families are increasingly putting some of their fortunes into crypto. Hedge funds are trading Bitcoin, which has big-name banks starting to offer them services around it. PayPal lets users buy crypto on its app, while Twitter helps people appreciate tweets by tipping their creators with Bitcoin. And in the latest milestone for the industry, an easy-to-trade fund tied to Bitcoin began trading. Investors can buy the exchange-traded fund from ProShares through an old-school brokerage account without learning what a hot or cold wallet is. It's all part of a movement across big businesses that see a chance to profit on the fervor around the world of crypto as a new ecosystem further builds up around it, whether they believe in it or not. The one thing you can say for certain is that the advent of the era of the Bitcoin ETF opens up the opportunity for Wall Street to make money on Bitcoin in a way that it hadn't been able to previously, said Ben Johnson, director of global ETF research at Morningstar. The winners in all of this are the exchanges and the asset managers and the custodians. Whether investors win or not is a big, bold question mark. Bitcoin has come a long way since someone or a group of someone under the name Satoshi Nakamoto wrote a paper in 2008 about harnessing computing power around the world to create a digital currency that can't be double spent. The price has more than doubled this year alone to roughly $62,000. It was only $635 five years ago. Supporters of cryptocurrencies say they offer an essential benefit for any investor, a price that moves independently of the economy rather than changing with it like so many other investments. More high-minded fans say digital assets are simply the future of finance, allowing transactions to sidestep mediators with fees tied to a currency that's not beholden to any government. Ripple's on-demand liquidity service uses XRP as a kind of bridge between currencies, 
which it says allows payment providers and banks to process cross-border transactions much faster than they would over legacy payment rails. Despite this month's return of crypto volatility, Bitcoin is still down more than 32% this month for its worst monthly decline since 2018, and other tokens like XRP surged to new heights this year. Ripple owns most of the XRP tokens in circulation and sells a tiny fraction of its holdings each month. XRP is an open-source technology very analogous to Bitcoin, Garlinghouse explained. But the SEC is asserting that these are investment contracts, that Ripple sales of XRP to our customers is actually an investment contract. That isn't true. If you buy XRP, you don't have ownership of Ripple, and ironically, you have XRP owners who have tried to sue the SEC for even bringing the case. Ripple has been showing rapid progress throughout its lifetime, and XRP price has seen a substantial improvement. With such a large market cap, Many investors are trying to figure out whether the altcoin can rise more this year. XRP resolves several issues faced when using Bitcoin like low speed and huge transaction fee. The transaction speed of Ripple is only around 4 seconds, and around 1,500 transactions can be handled hassle-free per second. Ripple Labs created 100 billion XRP tokens initially that operate independently from Ripple. Thus, XRP is the currency that runs on RippleNet, a digital payment network on top of the XRP Ledger distributed database. The XRP Ledger is open source and is based on distributed ledger technology. Since mining involves electric units as the computer systems consume power, this has led to greater exploitation. Thus, Ripple goes the eco-friendly way and is sustainable. XRP has been showing rapid progress throughout its lifetime, and its price has seen a substantial improvement. Despite all the odds against Ripple, the altcoin's price remained less impacted and propelled accordingly. Many experts believe XRP prices are highly undervalued and may swell notably soon. Although there has been some good news to XRP HO dealers, there were rumors of the case against XRP being weak. The price of XRP skyrocketed in 2021, despite the legal battle against the SEC and Ripple's CEO. The price jumped from 20 cents to more than 50 cents in February and traded above 40 cents until a huge spike rallied the price close to $1 in April. Later, the price eventually hit $1 and reached the yearly highs at $1.90. From the end of April to the end of May, the price returned to the lows of 77 cents due to the market crash on May 19th. The downtrend continued until July when the price was trading slightly above 60 cents. The month of August started with a bullish note. The altcoin broke the $1 target for the first time in over 60 days. Further until September end, the price is consolidating within that range. With the start of Q4, the technical indicators hint at a massive bullish pattern that could propel it higher. And by the end of 2021, being a fast and less costly cryptocurrency, XRP can quickly grab many investors. Thereby the price might hit the $2 mark with a bullish market. On the contrary, the pre-mined XRP supply can flip the price down. In such a case, the price may decline for a short term near the $0.56 cents level and may recover within a small time frame. Well, guys, that's all we have for you today. What are your thoughts on this? Get involved and let us know in the comments down below. If you guys like this video, then be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Also, if you don't want to miss out on any new future videos then be sure to click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification under this video so that you're notified the next time we upload a video on the latest XRP and cryptocurrency news. Until the next video comes out, you can watch our other videos about XRP or other cryptocurrencies. Thank you for watching, and we will see you again in the next video goodbye.